Hey guys, heading back from uh, Lake Grenada, Grenada Lake, Mississippi. Just got through with a bunch of classes, two days, a wonderful seminar at PTG Outdoors. If you're in the Grenada area, go check them out. Um, you know, Ron and his, and his wife are just awesome people, good Christian folks, and uh, you can't beat them. They've got the Cayman boats, the, you know, the Avid boats, the Avid boats. They've, they've got it all. And I'm going to tell you what, they are your crappie headquarters for everything over there. It's pretty awesome. Got to throw that in there for them because um, they're just nice folks and they have a lot of good stuff in there. And they have a lot of garment stuff. They have all the electronics you need. Pretty awesome. And, you know, and I'm going to try to come back every month or so. And... Uh, when I come back, I'm going to try to do a seminar every month or so, but I think we already got the month of uh, March almost booked up. I mean, I'm booking lessons out there. I almost can't do them all. It's unreal how many we're doing and, and the places we're doing them in. It is amazing. It's amazing the turnout for all of these. Here we go. We got two videos coming. Number one, and I got to tell you about this. This is awesome. Um, we are... I have figured out how to get the pollen off of your screen. When we, we are finna hit the season where pollen is a major, major issue. And I think I figured it out. Now, some people are gonna come at me. We already know. I've been doing that for years. I wish you'd have told me. <laughs> I wish you'd told the rest of us. But I've got something figured out. I think it's gonna be awesome. I think it'll help you out. And then also, uh, we're going to have an interview. We're going to have an interview with uh, Jason Kahn. That's right. I am in the process. I've already He's already agreed to it. And we're going to have an issue. And we're going to allow him, um, no judgment, we're going to allow him to set the, you know, set the record straight on, uh, you know, how he caught it, if he would like to, you know, he, I know he know we, we all know he caught on a rig, but how he caught it, um, the situation with the clients, how he guides, we're going to allow him to set the story straight. One way or the other, we're going to allow him to set the story straight. It may change your opinion, it may not, that's okay, but we're going to allow him to set the story straight. Um, I'm going to try to do that interview um, this evening or tomorrow evening and hopefully Monday uh, we will put that interview out with him uh, we will do our bits I'm, I'm not going to edit it I'm going to shoot it straight um, I will make sure that you know that it, everything comes out in the way that it was supposed to be come out we need to be fair to the guy if somebody is agreeing to do an interview absolutely by all means um, we do ask that for this if he is doing an interview for me we ask you to be polite uh, with your comments and polite to him because it takes a lot for somebody to stand up and do an interview knowing uh, some of the backlash he's received and a lot of the backlash and you know even some of the disagreement from me and some of the other people about it we owe him the respect to be nice and courteous and to treat him on our page and on our YouTube page and on our Facebook page with respect like we always treat him by we're going to follow those same rules so um you may can disagree with him, but try to do it in a respectful manner and try not to bash anybody uh, the way it is. That's all I ask y'all. So, because we're going out on a limb, he's going to go out and kind of push the, you know, he's going to be, he knows where he's going in interviews nowadays and he knows the disagreement and the hate he's got from some people. So, I think it takes a lot for you to stand up and say, you know, let's do an interview he's agreed to it which is really awesome we're going to try to get that set up so hopefully monday we'll have that interview i think that'll be really really awesome and uh maybe just maybe some people will get a different view on it you may not uh we don't i don't know but you'll have to listen to the interview so it was a fun weekend at grenada we've got a video coming out talking about uh pollen that's going to be awesome that's going to be really cool and uh talking about how to eliminate it and some things like that that's going to be amazing can't wait to get that out there but also need to plug i want to plug mirage mirage are starting to grow we're going to start seeing them in a few shows and things like that um and if you have ordered some rides be patient they are coming they're being handmade at the moment by one guy until we get the production phase of this going and 
just be pa be patient with me that's what i was telling you when you're doing it be patient it's going to take a couple weeks to get the rides out the door but you will get them they're just going to take a few days for them to come out um, um i wish it was i wish it was that time where we um you know could go ahead and get them out there and just be able to ship them out as soon as they bought but we're not quite at that place yet but we will be soon we will be soon check them out jb3rides.com or thegarminguru.com but thank y'all all thank everybody at at lake grenade and ptg it's for a wonderful two days over here now i'm heading home to go see my beautiful wife my beautiful baby girl and my little man i'm gonna go see them all and uh and just get home and uh take a few days and then we're going to church on sunday that's right can't miss my church got to be in church i can't miss my church i gotta get my jesus on the lord knows you know five or six days without jesus going to church man we can't have that all right guys thanks for watching thanks for subscribing ring the bell